Yo, welcome to Soto, which means speaking in a lower voice, which means whispering, which means it's a whisper rapper. It's a voice dictation now. I can press a keyboard key and I can start dictating and I press the keyboard key again and the text gets inserted into whatever app I'm in. You've already seen this with the biggest <laughs> drawback being you've been paying monthly subscription for it and that robbed me wrong and this is only $19. You get it on three devices, forever updates, no tricks, no hidden fees, no blah blah blah. Everything can be local. Speaking of local, you can download local models like Whisper and Parakeet. I highly recommend Parakeet over Whisper because it's local and it's pretty fast. So we're going to try one dictation with Parakeet right now. This is NVIDIA's models um, and it should be pretty fast. I have an M4 Pro, as you can see, the transcription was pretty fast. I personally use Grok Cloud all the time. That's Grok with a Q. It's, I don't know how, but it's free. And all you need is a Grok API key. And you can speak for as long as you want, sometimes even for five minutes. And the transcription gets inserted under like a second or two seconds, which is crazy. So Grok is my preferred model. You can use whatever you want. If you want, optionally, you can add your API keys. They'll be safely stored in your keychain to OpenAI, Google Gemini, and to all of these other providers like Mistral, Grok, and etc. And you can apply so LLM processing after your voice transcription. For example, here, I have these rules for like fixing grammar, removing filler wor words, and I can choose which model do I apply them with. So let's say that if I am doing voice transcription and I want some AI rules to be applied here, I can switch whether most of the time, I don't want any AI post-processing, but if I want, I can switch this to default rules, meaning when I'm done speaking, all of these default rules are going to be applied uh, after. And it, as you can see, like Gemini Flash is like pretty fast, so it should be fine. And we also have AI functions, which are like modes. For example, here we give you some defaults, like you can add them if you want. Um, so I have professional email, vibe coding, and Gen Z. So we can see I'm going to go here, and I'm going to say a bunch of things, and I'm going to switch the mode to be Gen Z. So when I'm done, actually with uh, saying whatever I'm going to say is going to translate it into Gen Z speak. So it's transcribing, applying the LLM, and then it's going to be inserted. And this is one of, this is what like definitely do not recommend writing your professional emails with this. It's going to be a very bad idea, but you get the point. You can add your own AI functions. You can add your own always on rules. How do you want to process all of this? You can add your own words in the dictionary for terms that you want. Um, the thingy to know about because some words like, I don't know, Fungar Zionate might not know what this is and you might want to teach it about certain words. If you go to transcribe, you can drop your own mp3 or whatever audio files and it's going to give you a transcription immediately. All of your transcriptions are safe, meaning even if I voice record but something goes wrong with the recording and the model doesn't properly transcribe it or AI processes it, it's going to be stored in history as you can see here. Like I have the original text, I have the pro AI process text, I can always go back to the original transcript even if the transcription fails you can always retry transcription with local model with a let's say you've been talking for seven minutes with a local parakeet but it's not good enough you can always retry with a cloud model or you can revert to the original process it with another ai like i don't know let's say oops i click gen z but i want professional email you always have your history here along with costs models and a bunch of other things and that should be it. Let me know what you think. One time purchase at Soto.to, $19. Thank you for the support and see you for the next product. Bye bye.